pet parents know caring for animals can be a costly passion. Routine care and emergency treatment can sometimes break the bank, and that can lead to some unthinkable decisions for families. But a local organization is there to help now. Joining me now is Sherry Sherrick, Executive Director of Laddie's Legacy. Thanks so much for speaking with us today, Sherry. Oh, thanks for inviting me. So first, I want to hear all about the mission behind Laddie's Legacy. What an amazing organization. What led to its founding? Well, Laddie's Legacy was created by Absecan Veterinary Hospital. And here at our ER and GP hospital, everybody is an intense animal lover. And performing euthanasias even when the animal is suffering is not easy for anyone. But when the animal has a prognosis for good, uh, a good prognosis for recovery, it's even harder, um, not only on the pet owner, but on the staff who have to perform the euthanasia as well. It's, it's very difficult. So um, we decided that we wanted to try to see how many animals we can uh, help avoid that situation. So we created Laddie's Legacy. And Laddie's Legacy is a vet bill assistance program named after Laddie, who was a big, beautiful Maine Coon kitty that we took as a surrender and saved from euthanasia due to some increasing medical issues. And uh, so how Laddie's works is if a pet comes in and needs a life-saving medical treatment and the family is not able to afford it, they can apply for Laddie services. Once Laddies get involved, uh, we kind of take over the, the cost of the medical treatment to save that pet's life. And we've only really been in business for a little over a year, about a year and a half so far. And during that time, we've been able to provide more than $17,000 of life-saving treatments for dogs and cats to save their life. That is so amazing. You never want, whether a pet lives or dies, to come down to money. So you guys are doing such amazing work. And I hear you have a big event happening this Saturday. So tell us all about your third annual Bark in the Park. Sounds really fun. Where it's taking place, what people need to know. So Bark in the Park is a huge family-friendly dog participation event. It's a fundraiser for Laddie's Legacy. Uh, people are invited to bring their dogs, as long as they're other dog and people friendly, and participate in all of our activities. We have uh, dog musical sit. We have dog versus human pie eating contest, participation dog show, uh, dog training experts, ask the expert. You can learn how to train your dog there. Uh, all kinds of really fun activities for dogs to participate in, as well as we have a beer garden with the local brewery, Dr. Brew Littles. We have more than 80 vendors of all types. We have 14 food trucks. And this year we have a new activity that we're really excited about. We have a future veterinary workshop. Sounds like so much fun. Sherry Sherrick, Executive Director of Laddie's Legacy, thank you so much for speaking with us this morning, spreading this news, and good luck with your event this weekend. Thank you so much. I hope you can make it. <laughs> yeah, sounds like an awesome time. For more information about Laddie's Legacy and their Bark in the Park this Saturday, tap the NBC10 app or head to NBC10.com slash finditon10.